What's up, everybody? It's your boy, AB. Welcome to the channel, and welcome to today's very spooky special, because Combat Master dropped a brand new update. This one is Halloween Part 1. Apparently, we're getting a Halloween series. Part 2 is supposed to be releasing or coming soon, according to their teaser trailer on their official YouTube page. And we have a new mode here. This one is called Fight Yard, and this is a brand new map called Heaven. There it is right there, heaven, but it kind of looks a little bit like hell with this red and orange glow. We kind of got the spooky vibes, we're fighting in the night. And as you may have noticed, we do not load in with our loadout. We cannot use our custom weapons. You spawn in with just a pistol, and then you have to go around the map arena style, picking up blueprints off the floor. Oh, shit, I thought I was gonna die there. You have to go around the map, picking up upgrades, plates, health, weapons, things to help you win the fight. And uh, it's a lot of fun, very different, right? Because uh, Combat Master has a certain play style. We all know Combat Master to be a certain way, but uh, look at this guy trying to hide back here. Uh, <laughs> there's a lot of little Easter eggs with this particular map. Um, it's very, very cool, very fun. Just get to bounce around and beat people up and get all kinds of cool blueprints. You have to pick up plates. You do have a plate system, but you don't have to apply them. Every time you grab a plate, it automatically applies it to your inventory, to your overall health. You can pick up health regions, blast around the map, mess dudes up. Come here. Uh, uh. And I believe there's a jetpack right there usually or a... Uh, what do you call it the little chopper paraglider 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 there's a paraglider that spawns right there but it's not available right now someone must have grabbed it and it might it might have timed oh. <laughs> sometimes the way that you approach these jump pads it launches you in a completely different direction that you're not prepared for along with the old fps arena style quake vibes they kind of have like this cool little like split gate system kind of because they did add portals there are portals around the map. Let's see if I can find you guys a portal right here. These shining gate doors looking things right here. These are portals. They bounce you to another part of the map. Uh, and uh, there's a few of them. I haven't counted them all, but it looks like there might be like a good four or so portals. And they kind of just always spawn you to the same location. They don't randomly send you to a different part of the map. It's always going to be the same, the same portal, same location. Very cool. Very fun. Is that thing up there yet? Oh, there it is. Let's get it. Got it. So there's a paraglider. There might be a couple around the map. And here's another special little spot right here. Yeah, buddy. Now, what's really cool is that this is only part one. There's supposed to be a part two, and they kind of tease like a brand... Oh, sh... What the... Ah! Uh, sorry about that, boys. Combat Master got me cussing in Tagalog. Shout out to my Filipino homies out there. Very cool mode. Very interesting. Like I said, I like the vibes. I like the energy that this new mode and this new map is bringing. Completely different from the formula that we know that is Combat Master. We're very familiar with the movement, the guns, the battle royale. You know, it was time for something a little bit more different. And just like the Demon Slayer mode, what a blast to play. It's definitely more of a party mode. This update was one game gigabyte to install on my pc i downloaded it through steam and uh yes we we had a leak that there may be a new smg but it doesn't look like there is one yet i know the mp7 has been in the game file since day one but unfortunately still not available but my boys be patient because if you look very very closely there's actually a little easter egg right here on this blueprint boys right around there if you look very very closely if you get the light on it just right you're able to see it you may not be able to see it clearly as it is you might need to zoom in on your device i know on mobile it is very easy you just kind of like pinch your fingers <laughs> all right my bad boys did i get you did i get you <laughs> happy halloween boys happy halloween hope you guys didn't get scared too bad uh but yeah sorry for the jump scare and no no mp7 that that that's real the, the, like i'm like seriously there's no mp7 maybe maybe in part two 
uh, I don't know. Not only did this update bring the new map and the new mode, but they also did some overhauls to the UI. Some of the menus got adjusted a little bit and we now have something new called the collections menu. So let's say for example, the all new Halloween collection. I have zero of 14 items. You know, the bundle here that you can get half of the items and then the other half you obtain through a separate bundle. So if you wanna have the entire Halloween collection, you have to buy or purchase both bundles. So if I make, if I were to purchase just the skins, they'd be there. It's kind of a way to, I guess, organize and keep track of what items you actually have. And you know, you may realize like, oh snap, I didn't know that I can get these other blueprints or items if I were to do certain challenges or buy a certain bundle. It's just a nice organization thing. And uh, yeah, these are the these are the kind of things that are like quality of life features, right? Because I know a lot of us, uh, we have a lot of these items and sometimes it's kind of hard to find and see what you have collected over the years. With the new Halloween update part one, we got two brand new bundles. The first one is the pumpkin heads bundle. This one includes three spooky characters. Very, very spooky. I mean, that's a pretty cool design, right? All three pumpkin heads are, you know, they do look different. They're wearing like these Michael Myers uh, killer outfits, I guess, or Ghostbuster outfits. And then there's the Aberration and then John O'Lantern. We also got some cool black and orange blueprints. This one is for the Sig MCX and other cosmetics to make things a little bit more spooky. And then in the second bundle, we have the Railgun bundle for $4.99. Here's a quick look at the Rail Rider R7000 Skeleton. This one is very similar to the Morse Sniper Rifle from Modern Warfare 3, if anyone's familiar with that. It's pretty much the same. I did manage to pick this up once during the fight yard match and it was actually pretty cool. Very interesting blueprint and it's nice to see the sniper rifles continuing to get some new attachments and stuff. And then most weirdly of all are these akimbo clap back dual axes. They're basically hands, and I guess you just go around slapping fools, I guess, right? You're gonna slap the Halloween spirit into people. And these are the kind of things that only Combat Master could think of. I'm thinking about purchasing these bundles for a future video, so if you guys wanna check that out, make sure to stay tuned, subscribe, and uh, yeah, maybe I'll be posting that video in a couple days. Very interesting times. I love that Alpha Bravo is continuing to keep up the pace with these updates very good look for them and i love that they're taking in the player feedback and they're keeping up with the players demands or yeah, i guess you can call them demands <laughs> if you want to keep your players happy you got to listen to them right guys all right guys thank you guys so much for watching if you guys enjoyed this video make sure to hit the like button and if you would like to stay up to date with all of the combat master content then make sure to subscribe boys we're on the road to 10 thousand subscribers we're super close if you would like to help us get there before the end of the year subscribe if you guys have been watching the videos enjoyed the content if you guys enjoyed these games make sure to subscribe greatly appreciate it boys and i'll see you guys in the next one and as always stay safe stay strong stay healthy peace